Hello everyone, my name is Blahidus and today I am playing some War Thunder again. This time the screen may look a little bit weird but that's just because this is um, the replay mode and not an actual in-game uh, video. Um, so this game was a pretty special game, it's one of my uh, best games ever. Um, I had a 20 kill streak and I didn't die with my aircraft. So uh, this is the um, I think it's I-16 or L-16, <laughs> one of the two I'm not sure. Uh, but it's the Ishak, uh, it's a Russian plane, low tiers, I think it's a tier 2 or 3, I think 3 actually. Um, it has a, a hell of a powerful uh, machine guns. Uh, seven millimeters, I think. Um, yeah, seven millimeters, and uh, it has some additional six rockets. So that's always nice to to have some extra rockets on you. Um, although I don't think I had any air kills with the rockets. Uh, I'm playing on a map that I um, I didn't see before. Um, not sure what this map's called again. Um, so, uh, yeah, here I got the rocket kill, yeah. There he goes. <laughs> um, so I'm playing in a party with two of my friends, so that's why I couldn't really record it, um, directly from the game. That's why I took the replay, uh, and as you can see, because the, um, the, uh, machine guns shoot so fast, there is actually always a bullet that's going to hit. I mean, an incendiary bullet that's going to hit. So, it's you're almost like 100% sure that you've set them on fire after shooting like a few bursts. Um, and when the enemy plane is on fire, it's most likely <laughs> to go down. Um, so here I have a very lucky dodge. Uh, I thought for a second I was down over there, um, but I didn't. I kept on flying. Um, so our team is not really doing much, um, except for dying and flying. <laughs> um, I don't think I, I went for the objective myself, because I thought we were going to lose anyways. Um, if you see the uh, the recording lagging a bit, that's also because of this uh, replay mode. Um, right now I'm watching while while commentating, so I'm not sure if this is my computer right now dying or if it's the actual replay that's messed up. Um, another issue with this replay mode is um, I think almost halfway through the video the sound of my engine is going to disappear so um, it's not because my engine died or anything it's just because the replay didn't want to give me sound <laughs> uh, so I don't really like the replay thing because it removes a lot of the the hood like you can see any targets from far away, you don't have your teammates' names everywhere and stuff like that. Um, I would like to see that actually, um, but yeah, it's good for like things like this where just showing off <laughs> killing, <laughs> and there's another one going in flames, dying. And there he goes. Um, so. I did kill still a few a few guys here, but not not too many. Most of the kills I started myself and then killed myself. Uh, and as you can see there, I tried to open the scoreboard in uh, in replay mode, but it didn't want to. It gave me the mission and the objectives and, and stuff like that. So that's also something that they should fix. It, they should put in the scoreboard um, over there. But yeah. Anyways, <laughs> uh, you can also see the screen going black for some sometimes for like a second. That's also because of this replay mode. Um, I find this really annoying. But mm, we can't do much about it, can we? Um, right now, I was just 
searching for some air targets and try to say trying to stay safe I didn't want to die but and then I quickly found some uh, victims <laughs> to shoot <laughs> I was really going so crazy while playing my friends were like oh Bladers, what are you doing you're so good <laughs> and, uh, honestly this is my best game as of now on War Thunder. See, there's another kill. Um, I am also going to uh, focus on my new YouTube channel. Yeah, new YouTube channel, I know. Um, it's going to be mainly modeling, animating and stuff like that. So, um, if you if you're interested in uh, in learning the basics of modeling, animation, stuff like that, then go by all means go ahead and check out my old my older channel. It's it's still in starting phase, so I'm now just like uploading some speed models, some speed animations, stuff like that. Um, but soon it will have some tutorials too. I've also already rendered one Cinema 4D tutorial, so. If you're into modeling and animation, go to that channel. See, this is the point where the engine dies. I mean, the engine doesn't die, it's just the sound of the engine which dies. <laughs> which is really weird. Um, really strange, strange thing. Um, so yeah, the I don't think you can see which team holds which base in uh, replay mode. Um, I'm not sure why it doesn't show that. I mean, come on. And there goes a Japanese plane. I think my friend kill steal me on this one. Oh no, I got that. I think. Yeah. Yep, that's my kill. <laughs> so our, this Ishak is a really good plane because it turns really, really fast. It's I won't would it say like biplane-ish fast, but it's like almost biplane-ish fast. <laughs> and uh, yeah, here's another biplane. Shoot a few bullets at it, and poof, it goes down. And um, really easy kills those biplanes. Here, I wasn't sure if I would survive that again. <laughs> he was coming real, really close, and uh, I thought he was going to crash in into me for a second and um, it's a MiG-3 Russian and there he goes so the Ishak yeah it turns really really fast as I said it also flies really fast it, in a dive it could easily reach over 600 miles per hour without the reduced speed notification so that's really good for a tier 3 plane I'm still not sure if it's tier 3 or 2 and then here I see this <laughs> Catalina and I was like, Meh, let's just shoot some bullets on it, <laughs> on it for just the heck of it, you know? And then over here it just crashes into the airfield. <laughs> so I get um, I get the kill. That was a really easy kill. I just shot stale for a few, few bullets. And here's another biplane. You can see how I outturn the Russian, uh, the German biplane. Um, I also try to make my uh, my turns really like underneath them, so I could have a smaller. Yeah, it's like you can turn a little bit faster if you go above or beneath them. Um, you can see that um, I can easily catch up with this with this. Uh, German pipeline. And here I had a little problem, but he decided to uh, to turn again, and then whoop, I had him, and then he goes down. Um, if you ever want to play War Thunder with me, then just send me your over or add me in War Thunder. Uh, my name is just Bladers. I think you can like see it in the kill feed. Um, but yeah, you can just add me and then send me an invite if I'm online. And then we'll play a game together. <laughs> Why not? 
So um, here I'm just being safe, looking for targets I could kill. Uh, I think I'm now about 17, 18 kills. Not sure. Uh, so yeah, it, that leg tree is also going down. I think he was like the number one of their team. He was flying Ishak to at the end of the battle. Which I was a little bit frightened of, but I got him at the end of the at the end of the match. <coughs> um it's really disappointing that the replay um is so laggy and and not like in game. <laughs> um the replay is only playing at thirty frames a second, which is fairly low because the game itself runs at 70 fps uh, on my computer so i don't know why the replay is like only 30 fps it just doesn't really make any sense to me um, here again i'm just playing safe getting some altitude altitude is always always good you always want to be above your targets. Climbing towards your targets is the weakest position you can be in. Um, so here I've spotted an, a new target. Again, the uh, the STV Iceman guy. This time in the leg tree eight. Previous time he had a leg tree six, I think, or another eight. So yeah, now I'm at 18 kills. Um, I couldn't remember this because people were starting to kill steal me at uh, at 18 kills. See there, as one again. <laughs> so then I I decided to just back off a little bit, stay a little bit behind maybe, and go to go to A and see what's up there. So here you can see me trying to get some altitude again. Um, as you can see, the Ishag is also very fast and rolling. It's not only good in uh, in turning and diving. It's also pretty good in yeah in roll and stunts in general. And it's a fast, a pretty fast aircraft for the low tiers. Um, so there's the uh, Iceman guy again, <laughs> and this time in his Ishak. Um, I saw him. I spotted them shooting down some some friends. So I quickly rushed in for help. And um, I think I got that guy actually. So here I switch over to to the HE, which was maybe a bad idea. I thought it by myself, but no, it isn't. This Ishak wasn't even hunting me. He wasn't even paying attention to me. So I just got on his tail and shoot him down like there was nothing. So I tried some rockets here, but they they failed like usual. So that's my 20th kill. I am now on a 20 kill streak. And I got the hero achievement and um, the survivor, su survivors achievement. Those are, I think the hero one gives 5k or 10k uh, money and then the survivor too. So that's it guys. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this gameplay and I'll see you next time. Bye.